right off of this tail. Now you were filling up, right? Okay, we call this a draft drive. All right, so do it again. Start all over. I just want the coaches who are unfamiliar with this to see it. Okay? I'm going to freeze you in this minute. Okay, freeze, freeze, freeze right here, freeze. Freeze. I want to show you why this works. Look, if you didn't cut it, if you didn't and you drive, I'm the most natural helping defender, right? And you pitch it here, I got a one step closeout, right? But when he passes and cuts, he takes me away. So who helps? It should be this guy. But excellent, excellent. But see, he's filling up, so he turns and goes back because of circle movement. I very rarely see your defender rotating and catching this guy. I know he should, we all know he should, but it's a kind of a timing issue. It's so quick, you'll beat this P or beat your defender. But you were right, you were filling up, and the moment he drives, you're going to feel back. It's a momentum change for your defender. Good stuff in the way. If, if your defender stays with you, lay up for him. If I, if I actually do stuff, you're in a natural pitch, right? Okay, go. Get a few reps. So drive, pass off once, pass and cut, draft, drive. Pass, pass, cut, draft it. All the way to the right hand. No, don't you go all the way to the right Start over. Here, here we go. Go for the layup. So one bounce off, pass and cut, draft him, draft, draft. All the way to the layup. Yeah. And that's why we drew it. Shoot your layup. Right, go. Keep going. Get out of your way. Come around here. And this is, this is perfect. See, I don't think they've done this. This is exactly the way it goes in practice. Now, keep going, my talk. You guys just keep going. All right? Bounce off. Pass to anybody. Direct it. Excellent. 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 Now, coaches, if we had time and we had five defenders, I'd put them out here and shell defense and just say, don't touch the ball. You know? And start working on that defense and let them see the timing of this. Okay? But that's about the best stuff. Oh, okay. I want you to do the same thing, but now pass to the corner and cut. The corner's going to draft you. Okay, sure, show me. Yeah, pass, cut, draft you. Excellent, excellent. Does that make sense? So I, I start working my draft drives into my circle movement, okay? I got one more for you because I'm going to run out of time. I want you, I'll let you do this, just me telling you, okay? I'm that confident. I want you to drive, bounce off, and of course there'll be someone in the corner, there'll be someone here. I don't want you to pass. I want you to dribble at, let's dribble at the corner. And when he cuts, I want you to draft him. Just turn the lean in and draft her all the way for the leg. Okay, go. Bounce off. Good. Dribble and draft him. Yes, sir. Yeah. I want you to dunk it and then celebrate all the way down. <laughs> You're, but you are right. Yes. And see, hey, that's excellent. That's my next progression is I want you to not make it, have to plan, turn back, and sit. He's got to be there. Safety valve will take the three. That's kind of that progression. More on that. What happens if you don't make it? That doesn't lead you to the next drill, right? Try that once. Go ahead. So, grab that side, dribble that, and dress. There is no defense here. There's no defense. That's why. Very good. Very good, guys. How am I on time? How much? 45 until 1 o'clock. Oh, shh. 45? Okay. Man, I was rushing through this. Sorry. I thought I had about 15 minutes. And I can back up and get some that I skipped over. I got some water. Just slow down here. Just kidding. Very good. Uh, that's why I was rushing through. My bad. Okay. Um, oh. Then I want you to do the same thing. You'll we'll start here. You guys can go either way, all right? And when you get to the wing on the bounce off, when you get to the wing, you can dribble at 
either way and then drafted him. So we re dribbled at the corner and drafted. When you get here, you can also dribble at the top. When he cuts, you draft him all the way for like. And you two would have to circle move, right? Let's try it. Go. Good. Good. Dribble right here and draft him. And one of the things that I'm looking for here is how clean, oh good, good. How clean can I do this? Yeah, keep going. You know what? Draft him. And I think right there. Go ahead, keep going. Keep going. I don't want to correct him right now, but he needs to reverse pivot to throw back. I don't think he'll be going. Drive, bounce off, take your time here. Now dribble at it, and then drive. Good, good, that's good. One of the things that I, I, I like is kind of rehearsal without defense. So that I can really concentrate on you guys being very clean with your action. You get here, you want to dribble at him, he needs to see your numbers. You need to turn like this and face him and make this obvious what I'm doing. Be very clean in your actions, okay? Because your, your, your teammates are reading you. They don't know whether to cut or, or uh, circle move, okay? Um, if you're going to drive, make sure that you break the arc. If you break the arc, that means we circle move, right? Is that good? Uh, great, great, great. Okay, now, gee whiz, this can go on and on. I'll give you one example here. Uh, I would like three bounce offs. Okay? Three bounce offs, and, um, and then we'll score with a dribble at a layup. Okay? So three times you bounce off, and then dribble at somebody, hit them for a layup. Turn it back. 
No, I'm sorry, I turned it back to you before. Yeah. Call pen. Real loud. There. You're going to skip it. Go ahead. You're going to open up here because I'm going to try to get around. Okay. So our first option is you're going to catch and shoot. And then you guys just rotate. All right, let's do a couple of those. Go. I'll be, I'll be the same. I'll be the same. Come on. Good. Open up. Catch and shoot. Good. Now rotate. Rotate. I don't care how. Good, good, good. You can put a chair here. You can put a minute manager here. Good. Rotate. Now feed the post for a score. Feed the post. Good. Open up. Feed him. Now feed, feed the post for the score. Keep going. Rotate. Rotate. The message that I'm trying to send is this is a great way to get the ball inside. It's not just another drill. I'm sending the message. This is how we can get the ball inside to him. Go on. Go on. Yes. He can pin. Skip. Now, put someone in here that's a little more lively. Go ahead, pin, skip, and sink me. Sink me deep in here. Yeah, try to sink me. Don't just open up and roll to an open area. Okay? All right, go. Keep going. Go okay. tell. So, coaches, in the, in the last session, we were talking about how do we teach our fundamentals and our offense at the same time, and defense at the same time. And to me, I, I'm always looking for two things at one time. So here's the pin and skip, but now I want to start teaching him about sealing me and sticking me in here deeper on this post up. Okay, go. Pin, good. See, oh, good. Very good. Good. Excellent. Okay, easy enough, right? Oh, while we're here. I'm not so deep, okay? Go ahead, pin me. Skip, open up. Feed him, like or cut. Like or cut, right? And so we just go right into uh, everything that we did on a like or cut. One more time, rotate, rotate. And I'm gonna take you through all of these. But, hey, when you're gonna feed the post, I'm sorry, you're gonna catch, he's gonna open up here in the post, I want you to drive baseline, which means you'll go, excellent, all right, here we go. So you got pin and skip, good, open up, drive baseline, in here. So I get layer seven and layer five at the same time, all right, keep rotating. Now, I'm gonna give you guys a choice after a while. I either drive baseline or drive the middle. If you drive the middle, he's got to go there, right? Okay, I'm ready. Here we go. Pin and skip. Pin, good. Open up. I stop the drive. It's in there. All right. Keep going. Drive the middle this time. So I'm here. Pin. Open up. Drive the middle. All right. Here. Yeah, and that's why we drill. To, to really work on his hands to be able to bounce, bounce out. Okay? Now, hold up. Coaches, this is just for the clinic, okay? Because each one of these, I, I, I'm, I will add them the next day. You know, we'll drill pin and skip one day, and then tomorrow, next day, it's pin and skip, now we feed the post. That day. Then the next day, it's pin and skip, post up, drive baseline, and I slowly build. So I'm not throwing this at them all at one time, okay? I just want to show you that. In order for the reader react to become automatic, non-thinking, decisive, aggressive, I've got to spend a lot of time in repetition. You just have to, okay? Basketball IQ is not as important as we think it is. It really is, okay? Uh, we'll build it. It's good to have it. I'm, I'm, I'm very interested in them knowing why, but I just need them to move where I say to move, okay? And that just comes by drilling and drilling and drilling and drilling. But 
but drilling is boring. And I want, I want to keep their brain active. I want to do the same things, the things that we're going to do in the game, but I need to keep their interest up. I can't do the same drill every single day. I know we need the reps, but I've got to keep their interest alive. I've got to show them, I'm trying to send a message that, look, I'm trying to turn you into a player, not an executor, not someone who just does what we say to do over here, okay? I'm trying to actually build you know, a game in you, okay? But I, 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 we still got to get the reps. It's the only way to get really, really good at this. So this is my way of trying to kind of keep their interest, all right? Uh, Right, before we leave this one. Ah, uh, come off five. Uh, I need five up here. And I need uh, four out, one in on that post. Four out, one in. Good. And I need the ball on this wing. Makes a lot better sense if you have defenders in there. 